What's going on everybody? Gunner here. Uh, I am in Mexico with Nomadic Waters fishing at the Angler's Inn Lodge and that right there is sunrise on Lake Picachos. I want to show you a clip and in that clip I reiterate this point but part of this I thought it was just good content for the master class is getting snags off because they happen a lot especially when you're warm water fishing because structure is the name of the game and so first off is distance when you snag up you want to get to about 30 to 20 feet away because what you're going to do is you're going to throw a roll cast and you want to make sure you have enough belly weight in that line to load up a de-loop and throw it if you get too close, it becomes hard to do, and if you're too far away, you're in your running line. You can't do it. So as you approach that fly 20, 30 feet away, you just arc up a nice high loop, and you shoot a roll. And, and the purpose of the roll is to not let the line flick over and pull it out. You want the line to splash down over the back, and then you rip up aggressively. And it's the rip that pulls the water tension on the line that went past it, and it just backs the hook straight out. Now, it'll come flying up in the air, and Oscar and me and Mike, we all duck in the boat because everybody knows I'm flicking that thing a mile up in the air and it's gonna hurt. But it gets a snag out nine times out of 10, probably 10 times out of 10, unless it's actually physically wrapped around a branch. So just one more tip, check out the video. I think it's quite comical. I, I think I even have two or three of them. So one more tip for you guys on saving flies, getting flies out of a snag, roll cast to rip up using water tension just like a water cast to pull a fly out backwards from the way it went in. Hope that helps. <laughs> you gotta be joking. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It's not bad, dude. No, that's a nice fish. I can't come here. I got a gnat in my mouth. <laughs> Bugged in the mouth. <laughs> yeah. Rip it off a log, throw it back, eats it within half a second. <laughs> the rod is by my side, so I just grab the line and hand line him. Look at that, on the bugger jig, it's fantastic. in 60 year old glass, <laughs> trying to get a snag off. Fantastic. 